Hello guys, good morning. Oh my gosh, I've been getting the best night's sleep. As you can hear, the coffee's going off, so we just have to wait for that, but I don't know why I've been going to bed at like 8.30 and it feels so good. But the first thing is I have my celery juice. If you guys saw Wednesday's video, I got back into celery juicing and how we're gonna do it so that it's manageable for us and also still getting the benefits of celery juice is that we're not gonna have it every single day, but we're gonna have it every other day. That was most important to me that I'm getting my celery juice back into my routine. But sometimes it can be annoying to make. I might be weird, but I kind of like the taste. Woohoo! Way down. Can I, can I get a ride? No. <laughs> Why does this hurt? We just lay down and we can roll down now. Okay. <laughs> So we just got home from Runyon. I'm having my coffee finally, and we're making eggs, and we just have breakfast together before Jared goes to work. And I'm just being really simple with my coffee today and doing half and half. You guys know I love my coffee creamers. Where's my little stir? I love this thing. But they've been bothering my stomach, so I'm just going back to basics, back to just half and half. found these on Amazon. They're these plant power sandwich thins. They're like little thin pieces of bread. So I actually have them with my breakfast in the morning. You can totally make a sandwich with them. And there's only one carb. Put them in the toaster and it's super good. It's breakfast time. So I have my coffee and this is the best hot sauce. I cannot eat eggs without hot sauce. This one, the original. So good. So I have it with the cauliflower crisp and they taste like kind of like cauliflower pizza crust for anybody that is thinking about trying it. Let me just put the hot sauce on it. And then I kind of just like eat them together. Like that. So I just got out of the shower and I made some pretty water. Those of you that are new to my channel, my pretty water is my lemon water. Sometimes I add in other things. I always say this, I'll always stand by this. Pretty water is one of those things that if you've fallen off your health grinder, if you haven't been healthy, go back to the basics, go back to some lemon water, and I feel like it kind of, I don't wanna say turns around the damage as if it didn't happen. Like say one weekend you're just eating a lot of junk food and pizza and candy. We did it when my friend Melissa was here, me and her just like would order Postmates and watch movies, and then the next day we'd be like, oh, we're so bloated. So I do think pretty water I'm not gonna necessarily say it'll counteract all of that, but it'll definitely get you in the right place. It'll help detox your body. Lemon is great for that. The other thing that I love is that if you are trying to eat smaller portions, this is gonna make you feel nice and hydrated, but it's also going to help curb sweet tooth cravings, which is great. So if you're trying to eat smaller portions or not trying to overeat, make some pretty water and it'll help so much. Guys, I'm literally freaking out. The mailman just got here and my Christmas collab is here. I designed everything. I actually have some behind the scenes of designing them that I'm gonna share tomorrow. Today is just gonna be the what I eat in a day video because I know you guys wanted a what I eat up. That's what we're gonna talk about tomorrow, but look how gorgeous everything is. Like, <gasps> this came out amazing. This is one of my favorite ones. Snow is falling, latte's calling, and you guys don't know this yet. You won't know this until maybe tonight I'm gonna announce it, but this is my second collaboration with Good To Be, and we're gonna be launching these sweaters soon so that you guys can wear these all season long. Like, I didn't wanna launch them in December, and then you can't wear them until like Christmas. Like I want you to be able to get them in November. So yeah. I have an event tonight, so that's why I'm just like hanging out in like sweatpants and or sweatshorts and a t-shirt. But okay, I'm gonna show you guys one of the easiest low carb lunches that you can make. And you can also make this as a dinner. You can make this the night before. Um, but you guys know my ramen recipe. It's in my cookbook, Pretty Earthy. Well, you can make that without the ramen. So and just have regular miso soup. This does all the work for you. I'm going to be adding things in it to increase the health benefits and make it taste even more flavorful, but 
if you're in a hurry, you can literally just heat this. This is from Trader Joe's. It's their miso ginger broth. You could just heat this up and bam, that's it. I love this soup. Give me like a, a little more than a cup. And then I chop some stuff. Ginger right here. So I'm gonna add all the ginger in there. We're not gonna touch the other ingredients right now. Just pour the broth in, okay? Now we're gonna heat this over the stove. And then I'm also gonna add some mushrooms. I just did a handful, usually I do the whole packet, but again, this is just for me. So it's so easy, all you're gonna do is bring this to a boil. I am eating low carb meals today, but I'm not keto, I'm not gonna always eat low carb. I just have to balance out my diet where, like the other day we ate heavy carbs, me and Jared, we had pasta, we had Italian bread from Bristol Farms, like, or just like obsessed. So when I have days like that, I then add in a low carb day. And a lot of you guys want to see what that looks like and just some creative meals. So we're gonna be making one cup of miso soup and then on the side, we're going to be making some fried rice using cauliflower. So I actually found this one at the store. Normally I have to buy all of these things separate, but they have one where it has everything in it, including spices. So. I'm curious to try this. Okay, so while the soup is heating up, just leave that on low on the side because this will heat up really fast and we want we don't want everything to cook too fast. We want it to be ready at the same time. In a separate pan, we want to scramble one egg. I'm gonna turn the soup off. The soup is pretty much done. Then you're gonna set the eggs aside, add some olive oil to a pan, and we're going to just add in the cauliflower rice. And I'm gonna add in some onions that I chopped up too. Okay, so I moved everything into bowls. Looks delicious. I did add a little bit of salt, so if you want a salt, you can. And then just take some green onions and top the soup. So yummy. I love this kind of lunch. I love something warm. And I kind of like the idea of having two things because I'll like sip my soup and look at emails and then I'll sit down with this and it's just like super yummy. And since I love everything spicy, I do add red pepper. So this is what lunch looks like for me and then this is also when I take my vitamin C and iron from care of So it's good to take your iron with vitamin C because it'll help you absorb it So I'm gonna eat okay, so then when I'm done with lunch I do make a snack like 30 minutes to 45 minutes after I just cleaned up the kitchen a little answered some emails and now I make a snack. If my lunch didn't have fat in it, which as you saw it didn't, then I make this shake. So I add a good amount of fat. So we're gonna be going in with peanut butter. And when you're doing low carb, fat does hold you over, makes you feel full. So this is what's gonna hold us over until dinner time. What I love about this too is it's really tasty. Cinnamon, peanut butter, we're gonna add some cacao, which gives it a nice chocolate taste. And my vitamins just chilling over there. I also have the rest of my vitamins, my probiotic and my vitamin D. And I have that all with this delicious shake. So those of you that don't know or are new to my channel, I actually work with the brand Care Of. Because as you guys know, I'm all about health and wellness and so are they. So they just align with me and just what I like to consume. They're just products that are going to make your life easier, healthier. Some of you guys who have gotten your vitamins or your Care Of protein powder have DM'd me and let me know that you are just excited to start your health and wellness journey and that makes me so happy that I can bring you guys products that will help you do that. So this time last year guys, I was kind of in a bad place health wise. That's when I knew vegan wasn't working for me anymore and I was really low on iron. Taking the right supplements from care of, changing my diet, both of those things helped me get to where I'm at now and I just feel amazing. And I love that you guys have noticed too that my skin is better and that I just feel more like me. I just finally feel like myself again. I can't explain it, but this time last year I did not feel like myself. It was right before I got the blood work done and I was just like, what is going on? If you're new to care of, this is what the products look like. So the the vitamins come out like this out of this little dispenser and they say your name on them. So mine say, hi, Sam. The protein says the same thing too. And I do use their plant-based vanilla protein. Throw this in your pocket. You could throw this in your purse. 
Um, and then you always have your vitamins and you can split them up throughout the day like I do. So now we're gonna be taking these when we make our protein shake with some nice fats. And the best part is if you don't know what vitamins to take, if you don't know what protein powder to take or what would be right for you, your goals, if it's putting on muscle, you just go on their website, take their five minute quiz and it'll tell you what vitamins you should take um, and also what protein powder would be best for your lifestyle. And then they'll come to your door every single month. They're actually giving my subscribers a 50% off their first order with code SAM50, which is an extremely good deal considering you can get protein powder, protein powder, vitamins, all that kind of stuff it is really expensive. But yeah, definitely check them out. Use my code, save some money. I will leave everything down in my description box. That way it's super easy and it'll take you right to their website. I'm gonna start with the liquid. I might have to open up another one of these. This is unsweetened flax milk, by the way, and then a good amount of peanut butter, so pretty much a tablespoon. And Ceylon cinnamon, speeds up the metabolism, good for the skin. Kind of gives it a nice fall taste too. And then care of protein. And over here, we're gonna add the cacao. And cacao is actually a really nice antioxidant. It also has iron in it, which is great. and gives it a nice chocolatey taste. Look at how creamy and delicious. Make a little fun, add a little cinnamon on top. Okay, so I just got my hair blown out. I love how she did it, like super simple. It's already dark out, but this is one of our new holiday tees. It says Believe on it. Super cute, and that's what I'm wearing tonight with over the knee boots. And it's super cute for a Christmas event that we're going to. <laughs> Catch it. Yeah. So we're going to be the last Christmas. So excited. Put this on all of our seats. Last Christmas. I wish I could take some for you guys. This isn't gonna be fun. I'll take it too. <laughs> For a classy dinner in the car. Hi, Poopalooba. It's like the latest I've ever eaten. It's nine, but we came out of the movies and we need like real nutrition. We had a little bit of popcorn, but we need real food. So I realized in this what I eat in a day video, I ate a lot of cauliflower, but that's what I've been doing. So this is buffalo cauliflower and salmon. Hi guys, so it's a couple days later and today's the big shoot day where we're shooting for the holiday merch. This is just what I'm wearing while I get ready, but I'm gonna be wearing these jeans. And so for the holiday sweaters and t-shirts, I wanted each to tell a different story and how I would actually be wearing them. So I'm gonna take you through my house. So the first place is I would love I always wear Christmas sweaters when I'm in the kitchen baking and cooking and t-shirts and I love to get in the spirit. You guys know I love to cook. So let me just move this. This is lights that we're gonna have. But we have all the Christmas decor out. We have some cupcakes that I just baked. Just kidding. <laughs> and so that's one place that I would be wearing the holiday sweaters is in the kitchen. The second place, oh, we gotta get rid of that dog bone is over here in the living room. We're gonna turn on those lights in a bit when we get started, um, but I love to hang out in the living room in a Christmas sweater, and this is the time when we are watching Christmas movies. We have some lights that we're gonna turn on on the table there. We have the couch all decorated, and this is where we'll sit on the floor on a comfy blanket, like Wyatt is demonstrating. So this is going to be shoot number two, is gonna be in the living room. I think I'm gonna sit here and have like cozy pillows. Um, and just how I normally would be wearing Christmas sweaters. I'd be sitting on the couch watching a movie. My makeup's like half done, so don't mind me. But I didn't wanna do the typical like, just like standing like Christmas photos. Like this is the outfit. Like I wanted them to each tell a story of how I would actually wear them. Um, so then the third place is actually in my car, so I'll save the behind the scenes for that. Paul's gonna be here soon to do my hair. <laughs> do you want to be in the shoot, Wyatt? He looks so big today. He does? Yeah. yeah. Handsome though. Not, not fat. He's you like know. the, he's like the big uncle that's like <laughs> your favorite. He's so, he's a big 